Hello everybody, this is Lilla in Hawaii. I really love postcard books and I love them when they're layered with old documents and things and I like to use the back of the postcards. I still have a fairly good collection of old postcards that I did buy at a market in France once or actually probably two or three times. So this is a postcard book one of my favorite types actually. So easy because the binding you just punch holes along the edge of each page and then thread twine through. The only trick is you've got to make sure that the twine isn't too tight or too loose because they won't open correctly. So here's the front of it and I put a, just a collage of different things. The back of an old postcard here with a stamp and a lady's vintage image and I have a few old crosses that I bought in France once. This is an antique and I don't know if you can see but it's got tiny little rubies on each of the four points of the cross. I just love it so I put it on there with a little piece of scrim. So I'll just go through some of it. I don't think you probably want to see all of it. So here's a postcard. Occasionally you'll just see drawings of mine. On this side, I haven't put anything here, but I found a label and I wondered what I could write there or put there. So far I haven't come up with an idea. Anyway, here's another postcard. Just part of my watercolors. Now on this one, I, I had another one of those little labels and I found this little, it looks like a Roman soldier, I think. I don't know exactly. It's a charm and it's so sweet. So I put that in the center there. And then of course, here's another postcard. So I'll do, and then, if, then I put, here and there I put um, old text pieces. So I'm just going to flip through because you don't want to be looking at this all day. And I like it when I find an old book and it's got someone's notes and this was in red. And let's see, what, what else here? Another drawing. See if I can find another postcode. It's so pretty, this this paper. I love it when it's all raggedy and sort of different layers and a few stickers were added here and this is from an old uh, ledger and in the back I've got a pocket and I'm adding more things to the pocket here but that's what it looks like right now and here's some more beautiful old script sepia colored which I love and here's an, another piece of um, handwritten paper so I've put that in there I've got to be careful when I turn these don't want to mess up another watercolor postcard I don't know where that is it's um this one I think could be I'm not sure, but it's an old postcard. It doesn't say where it is. I tend to think it might be America, maybe. And so that's her, that's the back of the postcard there, and the back of the book. And inside, there's a little treasure. I made a little notepad with a, a lovely vintage lady, some old torn paper. And I like to leave these where the holes were in the side where it was bound. And so I just collaged on some lace and some of my printed paper. I think there was coffee filter paper. And then there's just a bunch of papers. I think it's six pages. Right now, actually, I've got some more of this out on my lanai, dying because I'm out of it. But... Um, I like to just crumple it up and then out on the lanai I've got a mixture of one tea bag and leftover morning coffee brew 
and I keep it a little pot with a sponge brush and then I just painted everything with that. So there you go. So there's that and there's that and it all ties up with this. So goodbye for now. This is Lilla in Hawaii. Hope you're having a great day. It's Sunday here. See you soon.